Welcome back to my channel. This is part five of my master bedroom extreme makeover, extreme declutter, whatever you wanna call it. All right guys, in today's video, I'm gonna be doing a wall treatment on the wall that my bed goes on. I am tired of the blank gray walls in here. I'm excited to get some texture on the walls and some fun things going on. So, stay tuned. All right, so we have just finished up our school day this morning. And um, I am, I just put a movie on for the kids and I am gonna go to the workshop and figure out how I'm gonna get the air compressor here and the saw <laughs> so I can get started. So there is the air compressor. It's, yeah. So I gotta try to <laughs> get that out, okay. And here is the saw. So I think I'm gonna walk the saw to my house because it's on wheels. So I'm gonna walk the saw to my house and then I'm gonna come back and try to get the air compressor onto the golf cart somehow. Whew. All right, I walked the saw home and I got the generator on the golf cart. I mean, not the generator, the air compressor. Whew, I'm sweating to death already. Yay! All right, so I have the saw set up right out here, out the side door. Um, that's the living room in there. And I'm bringing the air compressor into my room, obviously, because that's where I need the nail gun. So I'll be coming out here to make my cuts. All right, guys, here we are. So I have the bed pulled away from the wall, extension cord, my nail gun, um, air compressor is over here, all the wood is on my bed. So the first thing that I'm gonna do is frame out the windows. Now I'm gonna do it the way I did my mirror frame. So. I'm just gonna do the bottom first and then the top and then measure um, how long to cut the side ones because I don't mind how that looks. And then once I have the windows framed out, then I can measure the board that's gonna go across here. To be daring, baby, dance the night away. I let my head down if I won. Don't you just get tired chasing fame and being pretty all the time? Doesn't sound like fun. You can do better. Let me show you what a good time looks like. You can do better. So much better. I want Let yourself be free and maybe you will find that there is more to life than being pretty Honey, let's just face it You can do better Let me show you what a good time looks like You can do better So much better
I got my first window frame up. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. All right, okay. now I'm about to do the same exact thing I did here over here. So let's just do that really quick. All right guys, so now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to measure four foot up from the baseboards and make a line across and then I'm gonna go cut my one by four and it's gonna go in there. Um. Take me out to California. Take me out to California. I feel the day. Alright guys, here we go. It's officially time for me to measure and cut the um, vertical lines that are going to go down. Here we go. Alright guys, so now is the tough part for me and that is figuring out where to put the other ones. Okay, so for some reason it's so hard for me to try to do things straight. I'm always like an asymmetric type person, um, but I'm going to want the, like, the vertical pieces totally, like I want one in the dead center and then two in the center of that one and the window, if that makes sense. So first I'm gonna find the center and I'm gonna put that one there. And then I'm gonna come back and find the center of each. Um, and then I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna put two under each window in line with the um, window pane. So I don't know yet, we'll see. But first I'm gonna do the center one. You better turn up You better be there when I shake Watch me rockin' if I can't stop If I should fall, just go ahead Go and catch me, baby
that part, guys. Woohoo! All right, guys, it's painting day. I'm gonna sand all the wood, and then I'm gonna like wipe it all down, get all the dust off, and then I'm going to do two coats of primer on all the wood, and then I will go in and paint the whole, I'm, I decided I'm gonna paint the whole wall. Um, but I'm gonna paint the whole wall with this bear, and it is in the color Polar Bear, which is what I've used throughout my house. I like to get the same color. That way it makes doing like touch-ups easier and stuff like that. So anyway, I am going to get started in here. So, so originally I was gonna leave the top gray, but I decided since the windows take up such a big portion of the top that it might look funny to just have this weird like gray shape, if that makes sense. Like if it was a blank wall with no windows, I would love to keep the top gray. But I think with this shape like eh, eh, and then eh, I think it would look weird gray. I don't know, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments if you agree with me. Um, but I think I'm just gonna do the whole thing white and then I am gonna get a really cute sign or canvas painting something to put up here. Um, like something nice and big that will fill that space nicely. And then, um, yeah, so I'm excited to get started. Try to figure out who I am Not sure what I'm doing here And the days don't work out the way I thought they would And before you there was no one who understood Never found somewhere I fit in All right guys, so I've let the primer dry for over an hour now. Um, I did two coats of primer anywhere where there were um, knots. I am going to fill in all of um, the areas where the wood meets each other. So I'm gonna be like caulking all of that and like all of the um, creases in the and I'm going to be making this whole thing look like one piece if that makes sense so like I'm gonna be filling in the crack and putting like the drywall tape across the crack and then like mudding it sanding it and making it all nice and smooth um, so I'm not gonna bother painting this and this because um, it's gonna be covered up um, so yeah does that make sense I have finished the first coat of cutting in and I'm gonna take a little break before I start rolling because I just probably need to eat and and stuff so yep gonna take a little break You're the one who can make it go away all you have to do Look at me Sometimes I I can't breathe But it feels like You're the one who saves me When I try But don't succeed Yeah, it feels like You're the one who saves me The one who saves me Okay guys, I'm kind of regretting my idea to do the whole wall white now. I kind of really wish I would have left the whole top the gray color, but it's too late now. 
I've already gone this far and I don't have any more of that color from when I painted my room a long time ago. So now I just gotta keep going with the white. Um, I could always paint the whole top section down the road if I really want to. Um, but I'm just gonna keep on going with what I'm doing. But it's all I have You know we could run to a place where we belong But I need you there with me to go on Sometimes I All right guys, I'm calling that good for my first coat I love it already I seriously love it already Hey guys, okay, so I decided that this room is to be continued. I do not like it all white. I wish I left it, I wish I left it gray up there, but it's too late now. But I did decide on a different color. I am gonna paint the whole top part a different color, not gray, and it's not gonna be white. It's gonna be a surprise so you guys will see next week, so make sure you subscribe. I also bought some decor to hang up there to hide those holes, and um, I have an idea of what I'm gonna do there. I actually am gonna return what I bought because I have changed my mind about everything. So, you guys will see what I do in here next week. Also, I still have to do like the caulking and the second coat on everything, so yeah. It is a work in progress still. I just wanted to end this video here and show you guys a so far thing of it. And um, I'll see you guys next week. Thanks so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe. Also, don't forget to watch parts one, two, three, and four, or is this part four? Is this part four? Part five? I don't know. Just don't forget to watch the first parts of this um, bedroom makeover series and I will see you guys in the next one. Give me a thumbs up, comment down below, let me know what you think and um, I would like you guys to guess what color I'm gonna do on the top and I will see if any of you get it right. All right guys, see you in the next one.